Thank you for joining me for this mini episode of Tinkering with Terriers. In this episode, I will show you how to replace the fuse in your Proster MS8233D digital multimeter. So the first step here is to take off the battery cover and remove the battery. The next step here is to remove the yellow silicone rubber casing. Now we remove the four screws, one in each corner from the case underneath. And when separating the two cases here, just make sure that the battery connector goes down the hole in the middle. Okay, so the fuse on the left here is the 250 milliamp fuse, and the fuse on the right here is the 10 amp fuse. So we're going to be replacing the 250 milliamp fuse today. So just get something underneath the fuse here, gently push up and pop one of the sides of the fuse off. Then it's as simple as picking it up with your fingers. Placing the new fuse on top and gently pressing it down. Now we'll reassemble the meter, doing everything in reverse, of course. And there you have it. Now you might be wondering, well, how do I check and make sure that the fuse I just took out is actually dead? Assuming you have the MS8233D multimeter, it's as simple as changing it to the continuity setting. The continuity setting, of course, will beep when there is a continuous circuit. So on the brand new fuse, of course, there will be a continuous circuit. Inside, the little fuse wire will be intact. On the dead fuse, of course, the fuse wire will have melted and will no longer be connected, so you can see no continuity. Now, if you, for instance, don't have a meter that can check continuity, it's as simple as switching to the resistance setting and checking the resistance of the fuse. Generally, a fuse will have a little bit of resistance inside. The data sheet of your fuse will tell you exactly how much resistance to expect from it. As you can see, there's a little bit of resistance on the brand new fuse. And absolutely no resistance, just open circuit on the dead fuse. So there you are. Thank you for watching this little mini episode on how to replace the dead fuse in your MS8233D Proster digital multimeter. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you dislike it, a thumbs down. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more of my videos, feel free to click on one of these links. If you have any questions or comment, feel free to ask in the section below or email or tweet me. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day.